everybody just a quick uh, before I go to bed a quick study that's going to help you you want to hear God you want God to answer your prayers you people you want God to answer your prayers let me try I want you to tell you this I've told this to my group several times we are on a very needy needy uh, planet we need we need we want we need we want right we always need something we're here on this earth in heaven we don't need anything we have everything we could ever want or desire or need in heaven Right, but we're here. So we are to set our minds on the things above every day. Always turn your Bibles to Colossians chapter 3 and read it. Study it. Colossians chapter 3. When you pray, you guys, we always need stuff. Ask God for stuff. You know, we want this, need that. I need you to help me with this. And that's okay, you know, but take take at least one of your prayers during the day and just give God worship. Straight up worship. Straight up worship. Colossians 3. If then you were raised with Christ, seek these things which are above, where Christ is sitting at the right hand of God. Set your mind on the things above, not on the things of this earth. For you died and your life is hidden with Christ and God. Okay, find yourself a book in Psalms that gives God worship. Gives him a worship. How about Psalm 65? Just pray it to him. Just pray. He knows what you just pray it to him, y'all. Praise is awaiting you, O God in Zion, and you, the vow shall be performed. O you who hear prayer, to you all flesh will come. Iniquities prevail against me. As far as our transgressions, you will provide atonement for them. Just go on in there, y'all, and pray the book of Psalms to your God. Give something that work. Give him worship. You know, don't spend every. I'm suggesting you not spend every single prayer you have asking God for things. God protect my family. Do this. Do that. Please do this. Please. Do. No, give him worship. Straight up worship. Exalt him. Lift him up. Set your mind on the things above, the things above, and worship him. Because in heaven, y'all, that's what we're gonna be doing. Worshiping him. Sure, you'll be with your family. We'll be with each other. We'll do, but we're going to be worshiping him in everything we do. Everything and everybody in heaven is worshiping God. Doesn't mean they're standing there with hands up around the clock. It means they are worshiping him in everything they do. Even if there's two people in conversation, they're worshiping God still. We set our mind on the things above. Here on this earth, it's hard to do that. So you have to do it. You have to get in the book of Psalms and pray it to him. Pray it to him. Exalt him and worship him throughout your entire prayer. I told you, there, there's mornings I wake up. Uh, there's been a couple mornings I wake up and I'm like, Lord, can you help me with this today? And there's also mornings I wake up and I say, God, what can I do for you today? Thank you for waking me up, Lord. What can I do to help you today? And I leave it right there. Okay, try that, you guys. Try skipping aside, asking God for stuff like that, and just give him straight up worship. Pray worship to him. All right, in the name of Jesus, God bless each one of you. Google Meters, the study is on my video, on my channel. Go look at your study for tomorrow night. Okay, um... Some of you, thank you for what you've done. Thank you for helping us back. We are Jesus Stewards. Thank you for helping us. And we're here for you, y'all, every day. Me, Igor, Tara, we're here banging our heads in that Bible, banging our heads in prayer with God to help you get in that kingdom. Okay? And thank you all for helping us back. Don't forget to go to the website, JesusDoers.com. And you want to see what you've done? Go look at the pictures. Africa. The pictures of what we're we're reaping, what we're sowing. Look at the pictures. We are really making a difference there. Thank you all for your help. Um, anything you need to know is in the description or go to my website, JesusDoers.com. See you at class tomorrow night. Tomorrow night's Tuesday. See you at Google Meets. We have 11 a.m. prayer time, and then we have 8 p.m. class time. So tomorrow morning and tomorrow evening, Eastern Standard Time. The code is R-A-O-U-B-O-F-M-B-I. Come to either one or both. In Jesus' name, God bless you. Go worship your Lord. Just worship. God bless.